Summer's over. Families can end up with lots of shells and sand, treasures from their vacations. Well, instead of letting the stuff clutter your home, CBS 2 Cindy Shoe shows us how to turn it into do it yourself keepsakes. We all love vacation, but a lot of extra stuff comes home with you. You know, they go on the beach or they go to, in the woods and they get sticks and they get rocks. And after gathering dust for a while, what happens? Throw it away. <laughs> Jeanette Zinno is showing the families creative ways to keep those keepsakes. This is the easiest way to put them somewhere where it's cute and really organized. So just put the shells in the jar. On a tag, write where you went and the year. Attach the tag to a piece of string. Tie it around the jar, and now you have your keepsake. Zinno also makes wind chimes from driftwood and shells. Knot the rope at the top, slide it through, and then you add the shells. If you use headbands or ponytail holders, dress them up by gluing on shells and coral. We tried it out on Layla. What do you think? I don't like it. Yeah? <laughs> <laughs> so you can always make it into a bracelet, even an anklet. While Layla doesn't love the hair tie idea, she does like using shells, rocks, and sand to make greeting cards. You can also make rings. Just buy a plain ring at the craft store and glue on whatever you want. The same goes for earrings. I got a chance to help this little boy named Emperor make shell earrings for his mom. Now, why is your mommy so special? I don't know, but she's really good. Time to give mom her beach earrings. Mommy! Beautiful. Let me try them on. I'm going to wear them right now. Wow! Oh, I feel pretty. Oh, so pretty. Thank you. Now those are earrings mom will want to keep. In the West Village, Cindy Shu, CBS2 News. Crafty kids there, right? That's a hit. It's working. Love it. Mm -hmm. Up next